Okay, we've got another comment on the YouTube channel in regards to the admissions video. This next comment is from Mr. Bill Williamson. Bill joined YouTube yesterday on the 13th of June 2011, especially to leave me this comment. So well done, Bill. Glad to have you as part of this conversation. Thanks for taking the time. Right, I'm detecting a little bit of sarcasm here. Conspiracy, not sure. Perhaps lack of education, maybe. Anyway, yes. I think we have to clean up our human footprint, not just our carbon footprint, our whole human footprint. And cleaning up the air quality, yes, is a great idea. Uh, my argument is, don't introduce something that is going to make it worse. All right? Not help, or not, not trying to stop things that are going to help. I'm trying to stop things that aren't going to help, that are actually going to make our air quality worse. Anyway, um, I think I should point out that the average age of an import entering New Zealand isn't 14 years, it's 8. Okay, The average age of a vehicle that comes off our roads, that means when it gets to the end of its, its life, is an average of 18 years. So it just wouldn't make sense importing a car that was 14 years old so we could keep it for 4 years after bringing it 10,000 k's and then kicking it off the road. No, we bring a much newer quality vehicles than that right now. With better admission standards, supposedly, um, than the vehicles, the majority of vehicles are still, that are still on our roads. Right, yes, we are reducing health risks and improving our environment by importing later model vehicles, but we're fooling ourselves if we think that that's the problem. It's not, it's the quality of our fuel and it's the way that we maintain our vehicles. Again, admission standards at Warren Fitness um, inspection times would probably help significantly. Um, uh, and why are we so far behind other countries with admissions testings? Don't know. Ask the government. Um, they probably know. Um, you know, they probably know we're using substandard fuel and we can't meet other uh, countries' standards. You know, it's, New Zealand's half a toenail off being a third world country at the moment. Um, why is Europe about to introduce Euro Standard 6? Um, the, aren't these standards the result of testing vehicles on special fuels on special tracks fitted with special tyres or is that just how the makers come up with fuel consumption rates? Don't know. Conspiracy, I see what you mean. Thanks very much for your comment. I'm your average everyday conspiracy theorist. My claims are lunch but they are quite serious. I'm your average everyday conspiracy theorist. My claims are done, but they are quite serious. They can spy on you with satellites, yeah, high up in the sky. So I carry an umbrella, even when it's dry. They can tell exactly where you are with every credit card transaction. 